Most people spending the day at the table surrounded by family and friends, but not everyone was off the clock. We're talking about first responders. They're keeping our community safe even during the holidays. Brenna McIntosh spending Thanksgiving at Station 7 in Virginia Beach. She gives us an inside look at how firefighters spent the day. Firefighting runs in Sean Liebold's blood. I grew up in the firehouse and, and Thanksgiving and Christmases at the firehouse were, were a norm for us. Liebold has 22 years of firefighting under his belt. His passion for public service comes from his father, Chuck. When my dad pinned my, his badge onto my chest um, at the fire department graduation. My dad was the, the guy I grew up with. He was my hero. and. To see that smile on his face uh, said a lot. While families gathered around the dinner table to carve turkey on Thursday, Liebold and his fellow firefighters are on call at Station 7 in Virginia Beach. For him, Thanksgiving is just another day on the job. The engines, I think, had eight or nine calls so far, and the other couple trucks have been out a couple times. Everybody thinks that everything's shut down. The, the fire department's still up and running, and it's just a normal Thursday for us. But the father of three says being apart from his family isn't easy. It's always hard to be away from your families uh, during during times like this, but it's just kind of what we do. Liebold says he's lucky to have a tight knit work family to share the holidays with. We spend a third of our lives with the 12 people day in and day out. So we always had that affectionate work family. And Liebold tells me he'll also spend Christmas Eve with his work family, but that helping the community stay safe makes it all worth it. Brenna McIntosh, 13 News Now. And firefighters not the only ones spending the holidays working. Hospitals, police stations, and emergency dispatch centers also remain fully staffed.